It's time for Uncle Hank. Question everything with M. Kalani Souza and Uncle Hank Ferguson. Hey there, gang gang. Hey, there you stay. Welcome back, you guys, to Hello. Uncle Hank. Uncle Hank, question everything. This is where over we question over, uh, everything. And, you know, I'm Kalani Souza. This is Uncle, Uncle Hank Ferguson. Yeah. So, Uncle, Bro. what's the question now? Bro. We have to have this conversation about what's going on with the Alawai. What's going on with the Alawai? What's going okay, on with the so, Alawai? So this is how nuts it is. The Army Corps of Engineers has worked it out with the state somehow. They want to do three, um, I don't, I don't know how you want to call them, like catch ponds, to catch the waters coming from the from the valleys, coming into Waikiki, right? By the, yeah. the through the Alawai. He gave. And it's like, wait, wait a minute. I, I mean, have we flipped out or something? Anybody living here knows you don't move, you don't block the water. It's like the worst thing you can think of. Well, you know, that's what they did. I mean, the Alawai itself is a nightmare, right? I mean, in the old days, the water just used to come up there. The whole thing was an estuary, something that they said was not in existence in Hawaii. But it was a freshwater estuary, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, white kiki, doesn't that mean the fresh water bubbling up? That's what exactly what it means. It's, right, it's right. It's about the springs. The spring. If you look in Kapiolani Park, there's eight spots that are green in there. Well, eight springs down there in white kiki. <laughs> but yes. I think they're probably tapping those springs now for the city water sauce, huh? Well, yeah, we have to talk about that too. Well, you know, that's uh, that's another episode. But, but okay, what's going so, on with the Alawai? What's going on with well, the Alawai? Well, see, this this is what's crazy. Okay, so it's all about protecting Waikiki, that one strip of land, the two mile island. You mean the two mile island? It's though. our two mile island. Yeah. Hello. In fact, all that sand, in case you guys didn't know, came from Waimea Bay. That's how we got waves in Waimea Bay. Anyway, that's another water subject. Okay, we'll cover that yeah, one later. Yeah. But anyway, back to the Alawai Canal. What did they want to do? They wanted to build reservoirs. They want to build reservoirs further up the mountain, up like Banoa, Pololo. They want to catch all those water flows that would come down to, okay, you know, by the um, by the golf course. All right. You get the, that one canal that comes down. Listen, right? listen, is it because they're worried about the flooding? Or is it because they're worried about the bacteria that's in the Alawai that is hazardous to human health? You know, both of those are true. Both oh, are so true. they're worried about it yeah. flooding and the bacteria getting all over the city. Yeah, all over, all over their sacred spot. So, right? in other words, their sacred site, which is the tourism hub where yeah. they're making their mega dollars, they're trying to protect that from runoff. No, take, I mean, you see them, they're building up the front every time because of the king tides. You know, in the old That's days, like, that whole area was where all the food grew. Oh, Ahu, people would gather for the food and go up to the big Kaimu, Ki, yeah. the Imu up there, yeah. in, and make food. And uh, they used to feed thousands, I thousands understand. Of thousands. People come over from Bruh, all around the you Pacific. Want, you want to hear how crazy this gets. You know how they got the tarot out of there? They had a mosquito scare. A mosquito scare? <laughs> I never even know mosquitoes <laughs> like taro. I tell you, it's, 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 it's insanity. It's insanity. Well, we'll talk about all this. Well, yeah, suffice it to say, it's that the... Uh, it's that the Corps of Engineers, these are the same guys who built the Alawai Canal, are now recommending some dams and some reservoirs up Mauka. To Maybe they want to save the water. Maybe they actually want the fresh water. Maybe they're worried about having water. <coughs> well, I'll tell you what. If that's what they're concerned about, it's the wrong approach. It's the wrong approach. You do not try to capture natural flowing water in Hawaii because of the... the speed. The, yeah, the speed of the water. I mean, it's fast. I mean, it's going <laughs> to... Yes, I, I like it too. Look at look what happened in, in New Orleans, right? Yeah, when the when the dikes. Well, look what That's happens kind of in thing. Hanalei Valley. Look what happens whenever they try to move the water. Mapuna Puna. I mean, people just don't get it. I mean, that's salt water in your roads. Okay? So this is all going on now. Gangi, especially you guys <laughs> over there in Honolulu. I guess you better watch your roadways, yeah. or at least watch your feet for the rising water. 
and uh, question everything that's going on over there. Yo, more than once, question it over and over and over. Mm. I like to be a part of a minority view. Oh, hippo, ike, ike, hello, ho, okahi.